Hi guys, look at this question. The question is 5 to the power x minus 4 to the power x is equals to 369. Let's see how do we proceed in this question. Just take the multiply and divide the power with 2. Now as you know that a to the power m into n can be written as a to the power n into m or a to the power m into n. So you can write this 5 to the power x upon 2 whole square minus 4 to the power x upon 2 whole square is equals to 369. Now let's assume that a is equals to 5 to the power x upon 2 and b is equals to 4 to the power x upon 2. So replacing this you get a square minus b square is equals to 369. Now a square minus b square is equals to a plus b into a minus b. This is an algebraic identity. So replacing it you get a plus b into a minus b is equals to now 369 can be factorized as 41 into 9. Now we can equate these two as a plus b is equals to 41 and a minus b is equals to 9. Call this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. Now we have two equations, two linear equations and we have to solve them simultaneously. So we just add them up. So you we get here 2. So we get here 2a is equals to 50. Further, you can simplify it as just divide by 2 on both sides. This 2, this 2 get cancelled. So we get a is equals to 25. Now putting this value of a in equation 2, our equation 2 is a minus b is equals to 9 or you can say that b is equals to a minus 9. Now put the value of a, you get 25 minus 9 or b is equals to 16. Now we have calculated the values of a and b. Since a is equals to 5 to the power x upon 2 as we assumed earlier. So we can write that 5 to the power x upon 2 is equals to 25 or you can write it as 5 to the power x upon 2 is equals to 5 square. Now we have same basis. So if we just equate their exponents x upon 2 is equals to 2. Now just multiply by 2 on both sides. So this 2, this 2 get cancelled as x is equals to 4. Now working on b, since b is equals to 4 to the power x upon 2. So we can write that 4 to the power x upon 2 is equal to 16 or 4 to the power x upon 2 is equals to 4 square. Again, same basis, just equate their exponents, just multiply by 2 on both sides, this 2, this 2 get cancelled. So we get x is equals to 4 and this is our required answer.